Hi, sorry about that. My uh, camera shut off. But anyway, so Murphy's uh, sign was negative for cholecystitis. We're going to go ahead and check um, McBurney's point. Any tenderness here? So that would be negative for appendicitis. And then we want to um, check for um, any deep uh, rebound tenderness. Let's try that again. Any pain? When no. Okay. And then so um, where you are, if you want to bend your knees up to your chest, okay, and then push it out straight, any pain in your lower right. back. So that would be um, Brudzinski's sign. That would be negative for meningitis. And then if you want to go ahead and set up, we'll... We'll look at um, the Koenig sign. Let me get it set up. I'm sorry, this is Brusinski's. Go ahead, flex your neck forward. Any pain there? No. Okay, so then since we're in this position, we'll start with neck range of motion. If you want to extend your head backwards and then flex it forwards, and then we're going to go from side to side and then rotating it from side to side. Any um, pain no. there? Okay. And then um, I would like you to go ahead and stand up. I want to just watch your gait, how you're walking. Let's see. Okay, if you can just walk towards me. So he's walking in a toe to heel fashion. Um, and then again, if you want to walk on your toes okay, and now walk on your heels. Okay, so get um, the gait is steady um, for his skeleton. Um, he is symmetrical. There's no deformities. Um, all the major muscles, there's no atrophy. Um, go ahead, close your eyes. I want you to stand upright erect for 20 seconds with your arms to your side. Okay, so there's no drifting, no swaying. Um, he is maintain maintaining an erect position with good balance. All right, and then we'll also check your spine if you want to walk over here. You go ahead and touch your toes for me, looking at um, a straight spine. There's no curvature, nothing suggest suggesting scoliosis. And then you can extend your back. And then he did his flexion. So now if you want to rotate from side to side. Yep. And then bend at your hips one side. All right, and then if you want to go ahead, have a seat. We're going to um, look at the arm. So if you want to bring your arms forward, that would be your ab abduction and then adduction. All right, and then if you want to rotate, I'm sorry, this is abduction. And then put it behind for abduction. And then <laughs> go ahead one more time. That's your flexion and extension. And then your rotation, and then backwards. Okay, perfect. And then from um, shoulders, um, if you want to go ahead, flex your arms. And then I'm going to have him do a few more movements with resistance to check his mu muscle strength. You want to go ahead, push, okay, and pull. Now push up and pull down. Good. So um, muscle strength um, in the upper arms is a five. And we're going to go down to the lower legs. Um, if you can go ahead, lay flat on the table. We'll check your hips and knees. Okay, so I'm going to have you go ahead and lift this leg up. And then we're going to extend it backwards. Okay, and then for your um, internal rotation, external rotation, and then also we'd like to do your adduction and abduction. There you go. And then I would like you to, um, for your leg muscle strength, go ahead, push down, good, and pull up. Okay, and if you can slide down just a little bit further. And actually, actually, just go ahead and set up. We'll finish your knees and ankles in a sitting position. <coughs> Go ahead and extend your knees. Flex that leg up. All right, so then we're also going to check um, the lateral, lateral ligament, medial, lateral ligament. Um, we're going to do your anterior cruciate ligament and then your posterior cruciate ligament. Now, any pain? Mm -mm. Okay. And then so for um, calf muscle strength, I'd like you to push back and pull forward. 
and that would be a five two pull up and push down great and then so he's doing his dorsi flexion up and down all right and then from um the muscles we'll look at deep tendon reflexes all right we're gonna start with arms looking at biceps That would be um, a grade two, not hyperactive, just right. And then for the tricep ligament back here. <laughs> and then your brachial radialis right in here. All right, he's a little jumpy today. All right, let's check your knee, your foot taller. Okay, and then we're going to check that ankle reflex at the Achilles. All right, and so that will conclude our um, head-to-toe assessment. Thank you.